hump day. It is Coach j &L with your whipping. We're going to whip it and flip it today. Who's with me? Woo! Woo! All right, guys. Going right into today's jolt. And hello, Yaya. Good morning. Mm -mm -mm. Magic and miracles are happening today. Faith can move mountains. Hello, Rita. You don't rent success, guys. Own it. You can't put a down payment on success. You can't rent it. You can't microwave it. You can't just talk about it. You got to be about it. Big ups to Dr. Rita. She's on vacation with her family. She's still living the VIP lifestyle. That's why it works. Big ups to Yaya. 35 pounds gone. Poof. All right, guys. We're experiencing magic and miracles here. Why? Because we are talking big moving mountains here. We're not just talking about it. We're actually doing it. So I'm going to talk about praise. Someone asked me, what's your favorite exercise? It is praising it up because the blessings come down, okay? It's prayer. You got to praise it up so the blessings come down, guys. When you're constantly using your voice, your mouth, your oracle for positive tools to trumpet and sound off all the beautiful things you have in your life to be grateful for, you're letting everyone know you're too blessed to be stressed. When people complain, I automatically see them in a little diaper and a bottle in their mouth or suck in their thumb. Grown women complaining and I'm, I just see them poof and before my eyes are like a baby a grown woman wearing a diaper stop complaining you don't have anything to complain about guys yes I know it's rough out there I know it's tough out there but guess what you're tougher tough times don't laugh tough last tough people do all right you create an impenetrable invisible force field of strength and protection around you it is so true as soon as I wake up I got start going through everything in the day that I'm happy for that I'm grateful for that I have a strong, healthy mind and body. I, I'm gonna be honest with you. Did you see the Glee actress? She was on a boat with her four-year-old. The four-year-old saw her mother go off into the ocean and never come back, guys. Wake up, you have another day. So sorry, John Travolta lost his wife to cancer. She fought for two years, 57 years young. Way too young, guys, okay? You have today. He has millions, he doesn't have his wife. Tell your loved ones you are grateful for them today, okay? Battles are won not by standing, but they're won on the knees. Sometimes you got to get down on your knees and just say, thank you, God. Thank you for my strong, healthy minds and body. Thank you for all my blessings. Thank you for everything that I have. And get on those knees, guys. And I'm not talking ninja knees. Yes, I got those coming today anyways. So get ready. Get your mats out, okay? So right now, prayer is the next level of praise. When you go into deep, that's why we're having experiencing magic and miracles. That's why you're attracting the right energy to you while getting rid of negative energy. Someone posted in our group, be so positive, it was Brooke Gillespie Trout, be so positive that it turns negative people off. I love to be audaciously positive. I like to dress in neon yellow so I look like a big ray of sunshine. So those people that are complaining and whining naturally go. Right now, praise is when you openly and publicly share your praises of what you're grateful for, okay? Now, that's praise. Prayer, on the other hand, is behind closed doors where you go into, you know, your war room and you pray and you pray and you call upon divine intervention, the Holy Spirit to give you the strength, the determination, all right, the discipline, the support that you need to battle and win your daily challenges. And you always come out to victory. That's why people are crying victim. They're not praying, okay? I know there's big problems out there, but my God is bigger. Who's with me on that one? Come on, praise it up. Gratitude. Practicing gratitude is essential to reclaiming and unleashing your VIP power. All right, guys, I want your VIP power books to look like this. I want you to be using it. I want you to be marking it up. I want you to put those, those post -it notes in there, okay? And actually, this is from a volume two because I've been working behind the scenes on the next, the next sequel. So let's talk about gratitude. Gratitude is essential for reclaiming and unleashing your VIP power. Grateful people sleep better. I slept like a baby last night knowing that I can't solve these big problems. I need to do is show up. All right, gratitude improves self-esteem. You feel better about yourself because you're like, I'm grateful for what I have and I'm gonna attract more. See, joy is the nucleus. It's the sun that makes all other blessings rotate around it, okay? Right now, gratefulness opens the door to better quality relationships. That's why all of us here in our VIP group are loving our relationships. It's not tainted or sprinkled with negativity or, or some kind of, you know, malicious intent or 
What's the ulterior motive? What does she want from me? It's just good old goodness and, and honest, positive energy. I got three more before we sign off. Gratitude improves physical health. Yes, I'm grateful. You're going to have better physical health. When you practice gratitude, it decreases aggression, aggression and increases empathy. That's why you guys are feeling so fabulous. You feel like everything is alignment. You feel butterflies in the stomach. It goes into a, like a little burning and happiness in your, and, and it's not heartburn, honey. It's like a joy in your heart and, it, and you're just feeling positive all the time. All right now, I want you to know that when you're grateful, it can actually change your results in advance. How is that? Nothing positive comes out of anything negative. So when you're grateful, you're automatically positive and then you're in alignment for your greatest good. So you cannot rent success, guys. You got to work at it daily. You got to believe, all right? So right now, you're working on your legacy. You've been championized, and this is the other word of the day, you're not de-evolving. Sadly enough, there's people out there that are de-evolving. They did the quick fix, they lost the weight, but then they gained it all back plus some and killed their metabolism. I want to give you the success tips for life. By the way, this Friday, we have a panel. Brooke Gillespie Trout, best-selling author, with her sister, Christine Couts, and uh, Brooke's daughter, Emily Huerta. I mean, come on, look at the blessings there. Next week, next Friday, I'm doing another master class. Yes, on Friday. And we're kicking off our three-day challenge on Tuesday. FirmUpSlimDown.com. It's free. Join. 72 hours, three days, 100 reps, no complaining, no carbs after four. And you're going to not waste any more time. Okay, and we're going to up our water, up our weights, up our reps. It's on like Donkey Kong. Somebody call the sheriff. All right, I'm jolted, guys. Woo! Meet me at 8 a.m. for our whip it and flip it, and you're going to be so happy you showed up for yourself. Do what you can. I'm here to give you that motivational kick in the butt. I love you guys. Let's keep it jolted. I believe in you. Woo! If you're not a member, join JNLVIP.com. I love you guys. Let's do this. Woo! Thank you. Sally, I need a headshot for your jolt on the 27th of August with Chelsea Nutson. So give me a beautiful headshot. You got so many, but give me the one you want. All right. And if anyone wants to be on the 31st for that jolt with Melissa, we got Melissa Tyndall showing up and showing off. Let's go, guys. I love you. If you're not a member, JNLVIP.com. Woo! Woo! Let's go. Love you. Love you, Yelly. Proud of you.